Good morning. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood, don't you think? It's a good day today and a good day to know the Lord. And every day is a beautiful day for freedom. The Lord is good and his mercy endures forever. Amen. Let's open up to Psalm 107 and verse 23 today. It says, <clears throat> Some went down to the sea in ships to do business in the vast waters. So these are sailors, right? They saw the works of the Lord and his wonders in the deep water. For he commands and raises the stormy wind, which lifts up the sea waves. The sailors went up to the sky. They came down to the depths. Their strength melted because of the great danger. They reeled to and fro and staggered like drunken men and were completely confused. Now, other translations there say they reeled true to and fro and staggered like drunken men, and all their skill was useless. You know, I am quite a proponent of being skillful. I don't think we need to go through life just floating along and, and not obtaining abilities and skills and training ourselves and letting others do everything for us. But sometimes all your skill is useless. Everything you try to do as an individual or as a group or as a culture or as the entire planet, your skills are useless. You can't get the job done. What do we do when we don't have the skill? We think this was our trait. This was our, our field of expertise. Like these sailors, that was their job to go out to the ocean and to make money trading, going back and forth. But the ocean was too much for them. Well, it says, then they cried out to the Lord. You know, it would be good to cry out to the Lord before you even start. But when you're in trouble, then they cried out to the Lord in their trouble. And he saved them out of their distress. God is good. He saves us out of distress he, he made the storm calm, and the sea waves were still. They were glad because the waters were quiet, so he brought them to their desired harbor. Let them praise the Lord for his goodness and for his wonderful works to the people. Let them exalt him in the congregation of the people and praise him in the assembly of the elders. It's a good time to praise the Lord and thank him for his wonderful works and all the good things he has done. Amen.